also probably have the cheapest uh, subscription plan to get all of these games, which is uh, half a penny a month. No, we do not charge you a whole penny whatsoever. So, do you, what type of games are you interested in? Shooters, fighting, adventure, and, and exploring shooters, fighting, and puzzle games, sports, little sports here and there. Okay, so we're going to take a look at some of the um, games that we have in today. I think I have about 50. Some of these I've played myself. Some of them I couldn't tell you too much about. Out. But, you know, sometimes a cover art, you know, back in the day, cover art used to sell games. I don't think that's relevant today, but we will check it out. And right now, you are locked behind the paywall, is which why you're seeing the PS Plus line logo in the lock until you pay the uh, half a penny a month. You'll be able to play all of these games once you um, sign up and uh, register your account with our store. Correct. You do not go through their store. You go through our store and we unlock all of these games for you. Some of these games are unlocked and then some of them are locked. Right. Okay. So, we're going to take a look here. This is 3-on-3 three three Basketball. I think it kind of missed the mark and tried to be what... Um, the other game was it was the um, NBA uh, 2K NBA like something like that but it it fell off pretty 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 fast but for the most part it's a nice pace game kind of slow a little bit but you would definitely probably like it if you're not really into a lot of sports games right okay so now we're going to move over to app zoo now this is an underwater exploring game i've actually beat this game it took me about two hours it's not one of those games that um it's like uh crazy triple a things it's just something to relax you and um you just search and um you uh unlock things to get to the next level it's a very pleasing game you ever watch ASMR okay it's kind of like an ASMR game it's very pleasing to watch the colors are beautiful those are very beautiful and um right exactly okay you'll be interested in looking at this that's perfectly fine so next we have Apex Legends this is a battle royale game in which you play uh, a squad of three and you try to kill the other teams and be the last person standing are you interested in stuff like that right it's, I mean there are a lot of battle royale games but this one is pretty good I would definitely recommend it good okay okay so Brawla Hollow it's like a ripoff of Nintendo's Smash Brothers. You play Smash Brothers, right? Okay, Brawler Holler is just a beat em up, try to knock them off of the uh, edge of the uh, platform type of game, just like uh, Nintendo's Smash Brothers, but it's just a ripoff. It's pretty decent, right? Now, if you're looking for a challenge and you are someone who likes to be frustrated then I would recommend this game this is one of those games where you're probably going to pull your hair out of your head trying to beat it yeah yeah, yeah you, you're probably going to pull your hair out of your head trying to beat this game right right I mean but if you like it then yeah now Assassin's Creed Freedom we're not going to get into Assassin's Creed eh, pretty much Assassin's Creed Bro Force, now this is a uh, funny little uh, 2D uh, character game in which you basically try to save someone in a cage. That's what I remember from it. Yeah, so let's move on. Call of Duty Black Ops 3. 
and not better than Black Ops 2. So we're gonna move on. So Call of Duty Infinite Warfare and and it wasn't that bad as people made it seem. It really wasn't. And you know they had to put this with it to try to sell this, but even this was good. But eh, Destiny 2 for a second. Okay, I wasn't a big Destiny fan, but um, Destiny 1 threw me off. But they had a deal for Destiny 2. I played it. It's pretty good. Would you be interested? It's like a loot. Grinder, would you be interested in that? Yes. Okay, so we have an updated disc coming. Yes, that means we have new games coming into the library. Of course, of course, of course. We always have a new games. Okay. Alright, now here we have the Exis Mankind Divided. Um, I can't tell you too much about it. Um, but I don't know what to tell you. Was it I played a little bit of it. I didn't get too much, too far into it, right? Okay, now, Far Cry 5, it's not better than Far Cry 3, but better than Far Cry 4 and Primal. But it did have me, uh, like, engaged. I played it. Um, it's like you're inside of this hillbilly town, and this religious guy tries to be God is trying to take over and well he took it all over and he's trying to keep it that way but it's your job to rescue the people and take back the city right 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 okay now we have another battle royale game which is Fortnite which is um the top game right now before Apex so would you be interested in playing something like that what did what the girl um yes she's not up there but she is she does look like the girl from apex legends doesn't she i don't know what's going on with that i couldn't tell you right 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 okay so now we have grand theft auto set address this is one of my favorite games i can play this game so many times have you ever played it you did it's good isn't it Awesome game. I tell you what, I tell you it is. Alright, so now we're gonna update it and move to um Grand Theft Auto 5. The online was fun if you're playing with friends, but now it's just a bunch of like spammers. I wouldn't even get online unless you just want to spend an exuberant amount of dollars right got a war remastered three it was pretty good right okay h1z1 now this is a battle royale game that i pretty much prefer over fortnite for a while because of the realism and the it's no building in this game just like apex legends there's no building and the gun on gun fight i was pretty bad but at getting the kills so would you be interested in something like that? Good. Hear that lot. Now this is like a uh, horror game almost. Sometimes you'll be walking the next thing you know everything turns red and it's like you're in the depths of hell. Right? So you this is a game where you're just trying to um, color the world. Killing floor 2. So on this game you kill something related to zombies right 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 so you just kill those that's basically all that is you just keep killing them and leveling up of course all right now this game is i i played a little bit of it if it missed second son this game was amazing i would definitely recommend playing through it on both sides of the field good and bad i need to play it on the side of I played it between, I was like eh, iffy between it, but next time I play this game, I'm going to play it on straight bad butt mode, kitten squad, you just shoot that stuff, I think there was some little Peter brought 
project. I have not played this one yet. No. Let it die. This is a real good, like, hack and slash kind of beat em up type of game. It is fun. Mad Max, I haven't played it. Um, load out. Now, this game is loads of fun. I'm not sure if it's still online. I'll have to go and check. But it was a load of fun with goofy little animations, right? Life is strange. It's okay. Mafia 3. It's decent. Nothing special. Right? Uh, Metal Gear Solid Feed the Phantom Pain. It's okay. Mighty Number no. 9. It was decent. Okay, so we got a sports game. We got 2K19 that just came in today. Are you into 2K? Right. Okay. Well, that's that's all. That's all good. Alright. Mothership. Mother Gunship. I haven't played it. Minecraft 4 PlayStation. Now, if you played this one, it's really, really, really fun. Is it? Yes. And you can build and survive and all of that good stuff. You can build London. I just seen somebody build London subway today. Right. Fun. Okay, Ninja. Ninja and Clash of Cares. It's a, a like speed runner type of game. Hack and slash 2D. It was decent. Absolver. Did I play this? I think I played a little bit of it. Just don't remember. Ratchet and Clank. Classic game, man. You, you gotta have Ratchet and Clank. Rocket League. Now this is like soccer with cars. And you hit a ball inside of a goal. But I'm just being a little. It's fun. It really is fun. It really is fun. Now this game is um, a good game. <clears throat> Great game. Um, at the end it is very surprising. Very shocking. And it totally threw me off. But play it. I haven't played this. Now, if you find the right people to play this with, it will be a ton of fun, right? Space Hawk Tactics. Now, this is like a tactics game in which you're almost playing like chess. And you have to position your uh, robot to the right place. So you don't get attacked. So that you can beat the game and the level. Space Lords, this was pretty good when I played it. I haven't played it in a while, but it was pretty good. The Last of Us Remastered. Everybody say this game is amazing. It's okay. Tales from the Borderland. I have not played that one yet. Tabletop Racing World Tour. Fun, fun game. I definitely recommend that. The Swindle. Now this is a game where you're like breaking into people's houses and trying to get out, steal stuff. Fun. Fun little 2D action. This is The Police. It was alright. Warframe. I haven't played too much of it, but I did play with a friend. And I had fun playing with that friend. And it's like another looter grinder. Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege. Uh, it's okay. I didn't play a lot of it, but from what I played, I really did love it. But it's okay. Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon. Played a little bit of it. It's fine. Zombie. This game was decent. Um, I think I've been trying to play through it for the longest. And I just haven't. I couldn't. I don't know. I, just, I want to, though. But we've taken a look at all the games that we have um we do have some apps as well and netflix um prime and youtube spotify and stuff like that right so let's take a look at something here and um now we have a few more, a lot more games that comes with this package. And guess what? You can get a lot more of these games for only a whole penny. See, just this is half a penny. Right? But right here is a whole penny. You get a hundred and for a whole penny. I tell you, we got the deals and you get twitch out with that you get uh what 
get the bait of a group. <laughs> All that good stuff. You see what I'm saying? Get Rayman's Legends. We have Marvel, Knack, Killstrand, Heavy Rain. You, Friday the 13th, the game. So, Detroit Become Human. I think that's the demo. But, you get to play the demos of these games. Um, but, like, yeah. You get to play all of these games for only a, penny, a full penny. And, you know, we got PlayStation Plus. Stuff like that. So, now that we've taken a look at all the games, would you be interested in joining the uh, club, the subscription? Which subscription would you like, the half a penny or the whole penny? All good, okay. And can I get your email address? You need to think of a unique four-digit pin that you want to use. Okay. And let's see. Can I get your credit card? Okay, thank you. Um, would you like a uh, rewards card? Um, with this card, if you sign up today, You'll be able to get 30% off of your next purchase right? And as you use that card, you add up points. And once you reach um, a certain level of points, you'll be able to use those points to uh, purchase video games and accessories of that nature. Would you like to sign up? Okay. So, sign you up. And I believe you are good. So, thank you for signing up for our service. Like I said, everything's going digital now to streaming. And we are the first 